if she shaved or not. Oh, yeah. If they aren't asking you questions, they don't care. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Do you guys really feel no attachment after sex? Welcome back to another video. My name is Patricia. If you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button and join my journey. Let me so introduce <laughs> my guests of today. Everyone knows Ivan. That is. I'm done. And that is. Thank you. So, guys, I've got them here today with me because they're going to be doing and answering questions that girls are too afraid to ask guys. And. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Are you right there, Ivan? Yeah. He's, he's, really, he's regretting his answer. No, already. really, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Right, so let's do the first question. Go. <laughs> now we're going to go with an easy one, okay? Oh, we're going directly What do you it. think of yeah, all the good. selfies girls post on social, social media? So selfies like like that, not like body ones. and Just the face? Face, yeah. What do you guys honestly think about it? I mean, I post some, so... <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Yeah, it can Nothing at all? No. You don't think it's too much, too little? No. No? No. Uh, that's a bit... <laughs> I don't know. I mean, what? Selfies <laughs> in terms of just face-wise? It's just a pet. No, I have nothing against it, but I don't think it's a bit too much when, like, oh, you're driving and then you're stopping the fucking traffic light. And then you're going... Oh, yeah, but then you've got a... <laughs> <laughs> Come on, there's a moment in the place. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I don't. Yeah, when you're driving. When you're in the bus. Fun. I don't think Ivan spends enough time on social media to even know what goes on. That's also do. true, to be fair. Right, let's go to the next question. This one will be more talkative. What makes a girl dateable versus a fling? <laughs> For me? Oh, I knew he was going to be the first one. <laughs> I'm probably going to agree with 90% of what Danny says, but... Right, let's, let, oh, let's let Danny speak. Danny, you answer this one. There's, there's, there's All right, let's do so it like much. this. When I answer a question, I'll pick someone to start the thing, and then everyone else will debate it. Yeah? Yeah, 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 Danny can start with it. You can start with it. A lot. Okay, what's okay. okay. a dateable girl for you? Is, wait, so hold on, is dateable more? Yeah, dateable, oh, obviously, a fling is like one Yeah, fling, fling enough, okay, so... Dateable, so with me, I'll only have dates with a girl if I can see a relationship at the end of it. Otherwise, you're a fling, right? Okay. So, and then there's way too many boxes. I need to, and I would only ever have a relationship if I can see a future. There's no point having a relationship if you can see it's gonna end in a year. Yeah, but like, if you see a girl, let's just say you meet a girl, like, tomorrow you chat with her, what would you think, okay, she's dateable? What would she say or what would she do that you would say, okay, she's dateable? Check. <sighs> It's hard to verbalise, but there's a lot of shit. <laughs> Basically, I swear. It's fine, it's fine, don't worry. She doesn't also have words. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, so she's got to be a nice person, obviously. Um, she's got to have like values that I have. We need to share like values, so be it about family, about friends, like that's key. Um, she's she's got I don't know. She's got to be with me personally. I'm very outgoing, so she's got to have like something about her. She can't just be, you know, very plain yeah. and very, mm, yeah. Okay, a fling. She has to have a bit what of would you put sword. straight away as a fling? Like, a fling. Anything that she's doesn't fit. fall into those categories. Yeah. Basically. Yeah. 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 Summary. She's fit, but we don't suit. No, but yeah, there's, like I said, there's, there's, there's a lot of boxes and that's just like three or four boxes. What about my, about, what about my opinion? There's a thousand boxes. You go, you go. Thank you, thank you. Um, no, I agree with Danny. Uh, one has that's to be. a great opinion, to be fair. <laughs> Thanks, not, man. <laughs> no, um, being family oriented is very key, yeah. very essential. Um, wants to. Um, I think that's a cultural thing, you know. Yeah, we are Spanish, aren't we? <laughs> I have no idea. We're all laughing already. <laughs> no banter, make same sense of humour. Oh, banter, big does, box. Doesn't get big angry box. very easily, very easy going, very yeah. understanding, just very laid back. Um, Right, this one is a tough one, yeah? Does sex on a first date mean she's not girlfriend material? This is gonna go to... Ivan. Uh, yes, the fiance. <laughs> wow. This, this is a big one. Sex on a first date, yeah. And this doesn't mean we have sex on the first date, by the way, guys. Yeah, uh, for me, it's a... Uh, it, that's a tough one, because I don't want to hurt anyone. Have you, have you had sex on your first what date? What does that mean? I have, and they've never been my own in relationship with me. There you go. So, <laughs> well, I mean, something. <laughs> for, for me, for me, if you're having sex in a first date, I mean, no. It depends it's what not, you're going for, though. Yeah, but it's not a relationship. Okay. 
Yeah. What do you think, David? <laughs> so I don't think it's a bad thing. It's not about it, being a it, bad thing, it's about it's sex in a first day. Why can't it not lead to... Date. End up date. Being a, not date. So it's not like, not, oh, I meet no, you, you said today. Day. No. First <laughs> date. You said date. No, I said date. <laughs> I won't go back and shoot. You said date, date, date. Why can it not lead to it potentially ended up being boyfriend and girlfriend? On your first date? Why not? Oh, I thought you meant I mean, date as in like when you no, first no, no, meet no. someone. When you go on a date no, so go on, change your answer then. If, you're gonna if, if it's on a first date yeah, where date. you've been speaking to the, yeah. to the girl for like, yeah, yeah. let's say a couple of months, Sorry. that's fine. Yeah. But after, you meant that's after two months of chatting? Well, you never know what I did, yeah. <laughs> I, was, I was busy at college playing football, etc., etc. There was like I was going through a lot as well at that time. So, no, I but I thought so. I thought you meant day, no. and like when you first meet the person, like but, you're but, out and about. A lot of and first dates are literally we've met. Do you want to go out on a date? And then you go out in a, on a date like yeah, the see, second time you've ever met. That's the second time though. Yeah, but, but it's not the first the, date. Yeah, but it's not the first day. She said date, man. I know, but that's I what know, I'm saying. Like if, I said, if, for example, I meet a girl. And I, I'm in a nightclub, and I go back to hers. That's not. That's not. That's a date, not. Is it? Yeah, but that's not gonna go. That's the first day, D A Y. So then I wouldn't go for her as a relationship, because then I can just see her going to a nightclub just, by herself yeah. and doing it again. I think that sex on first date is fine. Date, yeah. However, as I said, date, date, fine. Yeah, yeah. but even first date is fine. It doesn't mean I'm not saying it's not fine. He just you're, said you wouldn't. Date. I wouldn't. Personally, fall yeah. into, go into a relationship with her because the same yeah, way that doesn't mean something. I think I think girls think that it means something if they have sex on the first day or date or whatever it is. I don't think it. I've never I don't really think it fun. means something. It doesn't mean that now you're not eligible. Personally, as a girl, I no. just don't feel comfortable enough to do anything with a person on the first. Date. And to be fair, on the date. first day, on the first That's day that you meet someone, um, unless she's pretty drunk, she's not going to remember you. <laughs> Depends how good you are. That's true. Mm -hmm. That is true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right, next question. Moving on. Wait, <laughs> how did it get disappeared? Oh, why do you guys disappear or ghost instead of talking to a girl? Wait, disappear? Yeah, instead of talking to a girl and tell her she's not interested. Tell them. Tell her, yeah, that they're not interested anymore. So why do you guys ghost? Why can't you just tell a girl like I don't want to? Who's taking this one? <laughs> I love how you find this automatically went. Daniel. No, I, ju I, I, personally I don't even wait, Daniel, shush. Daniel. I, I, I don't personally do that, I'm quite, I'm quite honest and upfront. Like, from the beginning I'm honest, and if things aren't happy, I'm, I'm genuine about it. Okay. But I, I wouldn't just stop talking to someone. But have you so. ever ghosted someone? I've, I've ghosted one person. Yeah, I think it's... Uh, He's definitely ghosted I think, one person. I, think I, I wouldn't say he would have ghosted, but it's just, I think it's the... Maybe... Oh, I, I think, think, I think a lot of people do it to let them down, sorry, to let, sorry. <laughs> I think they do it to let them down like softly and also because they're, they're being slightly cowardly and not wanting to confront that conversation because it yeah. is awkward. Yeah. Exactly. But, but it's not the correct thing to do. And also maybe it's a fear of hurting the other person's feelings as well. True. I think it depends so why, you avoid that why did you do it? It was mainly because of that. I just could, I, I didn't want to hurt the other person's feelings. So I just said, you know what? I'm going to take the selfish approach, which was distance myself and try to avoid any kind of interaction with that person. Yeah. So to the point where like, I just, in my head, thought the ideal thing, even though it was obviously incorrect, was to let it fade away. To a point where like maybe at a certain future, uh, we can just gradually start talking again and forget whatever happened in the past. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't personally do it, but... I think... I think, like, I think it's just better to be honest. But like, not every guy is... That, that one way that they're genuine and honest a lot of people are, like there's a lot of guys that are just I still a rude word but I, I won't say it but yeah. just you know just <laughs> I still feel like me personally I'm very unless people can probably vouch for this I'm very like um, scared when it comes to doing that first step even when it comes to opening my feelings and stuff like that so, by the way guys they're both single so <laughs> <laughs> um, well seven <laughs> <laughs> That is true. Well, half of his life. Okay, guys. <laughs> right, next question. What's the sex sexiest thing a girl has ever done for you? Sexiest, not cute, sweet, sexiest. Oh, uh, I don't think I should say it. This is inappropriate completely. Here I am. <laughs> Go on, you have to answer, guys. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll come up with the second one. I'll right. say the first one. David, you start. What's the sexiest thing? 
Дани? <laughs> Иван от Дани е Дани. Откакото се е за хо, е да знат се мен. Това е малко, бе. I say the second one because the first one's very stressed if it's not me. Not 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 what's, what's, what's the sexiest like? Can what do you class? I don't know. This, this one, this one, with mine, was quite broad. I was, uh, I was sort of seeing this girl at uni, and then. Um, so she don't see this. Do no, nah, she she won't. <laughs> She's, she lives in Cyprus, and no. <laughs> um, yeah, so basically she was like, oh yeah, come around mine. Like we agreed that I'd go around like hers at like eight or something at night, blah blah, and I just pitched up, and it was like. Romantic slash sexy, which is quite nice. Um, and essentially, I pitched up, and she was like, just in full on lingerie, and like Ooh. everything was popping, and like there was candles everywhere, like there was strawberries all over the place, like red wine. I was like, this is I can I can do this. <laughs> um, but it was a bit awkward because I was I was thinking of breaking up with her at the time, like stopping what we were doing. Um, no. Yeah, I mean, you changed your mind. Yeah, I did. <laughs> for a little bit, just for that, just for that day. Go on, yeah. David, Ivan. David, go. On. Uh, I'm just happy with a romantic dinner, and I'm very plain and simple. Aww. Yeah, I'm very That's not for really what a girl's ever done that's sexy. A romantic dinner. Sexy. Oh, romantic, sexy. oh sorry. I, I actually thought it was like romantic. Don't be too raunchy. Um, Keep it slightly PG. I mean, to be fair, I know what Lanny's first one is, but I can't really say. I don't even know. I'll tell you guys after this video. I know it's just it, not PG. I know it's it. just not PG, actually. I, I know what it is. <laughs> you probably do. I'm going to be boring and not answer. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. That's Go on, Sorry. it up, you! We'll take you, it doesn't matter if it's not me, What's I'm not stressed. Done? Come on. <laughs> not, I, I can't think about it. Actually, never... don't say what I've done, because yeah, cool. Say cause, something cause, like that. Let's, okay? let's keep watching this. <laughs> yeah, Pat's an angel. Okay? <laughs> Pat is still a virgin. <laughs> you, can be, you can be an angel and be sexy. <laughs> That's true. So am I, guys. <laughs> um, yeah, I've done it, to be fair. I can't think of anything that's uh, it's been... Okay, never mind. Next question. Yeah, I think this was a odd question. This one is a bit weird. Oh, this right. next one. So Danny's definitely going first. <laughs> do, you care, do you care if she shaved or not? To be fair. Hell yeah, I care. <laughs> she better be baby smooth. I don't want to be surprised when I look, but it. I mean, like, no, no, wait, wait, wait. There. I mean, yeah, not far. if she's the Amazon rainforest. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That, like, hello. Dude, if I'm gonna, there, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna find. But like, technically, women are like, like, meant to have that there, though. That's yeah, no, but gene, bro. Like, you don't want to see some like the same as you wouldn't want to see some. Yeah, like it's just there's a tidy, tidy. It can be there, but if I take care of myself, I expect my missus. We're cutting people, right? So it's got to be sort of. Yeah, gene is cute, guys. Yeah, I think um, I don't mind it. Beaten. Depends on how it is. No, I mean you can trim it down and and keep it neat and tidy, but like don't have a massive like as soon as you take your knick knicks off, it just. Afro. <laughs> 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 yeah, I mean. Okay, next question. How do you feel walking Thanks. around with your girl when she's looking mm -hmm. extra good and guys are staring? Wow! Wow! Fucking yes, Hell go yeah, man. man. Yes. What, what? Queen. <laughs> Not really. Some guys don't like it. Some guys will be like, change that skirt, change that dress. Nah, 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 nah. People that do that insecure. Yeah. Hundred percent. No. Or, or I see it as as well. Like if a guy's so scared of like. Let's say a guy says to me, "Oh, take that off." I've had that before. Like, don't wear this. Don't do that. Not for me. Don't do this. Don't do that. I feel like that's what they're doing when they're out and about looking at girls like that. That's why they're so scared of a girl, like girl. You're, ba like that. you're basically showing your insecurity yeah. and that you're scared of losing your girl, and you think that she. And you also, it seems like you don't trust your girl. Exactly. Yeah. I think trust is key. Sure. <laughs> trust is obviously key. And if yeah. you're like, if that's you don't that's, trust that's your an alarming alert that, to me. Like, that's a red if flag. a guy says to me, "Take that off," that's it. Like, yeah, straight. It should <laughs> that's be. Why, it that's should why be. Pat walks around half naked. <laughs> you don't say shit. And I don't say shit. <laughs> no, I would be super proud. I'd do like literally a runway for her. Like, to so be fair, at the end of the day, pictures. you're the one that's going home. We take all the pictures she wants. Do you know what I mean? You're I the one trust. holding her hand. It depends. If she's if she's dressed like very sexual and she's flirting with other guys, then obviously. But well, that's flirting with other guys. That's different. But that's different to what you are. Flirting, flirting, like flirting ain't doing anything. That's true. Flirting is part of my DNA. <laughs> the next question: How can you tell? Like, how can we tell a guy's uninterested? Ooh. Like, what do you guys do, like, to show, like, man... Nah, Stop like, talking as much. <laughs> Stop being, talking as much. Being dry with your responses. Yeah. Taking longer to respond. No X's at the end of the sentences. 
Yeah, but so, I, some people just don't put X's anyway. I'm a sort of person, I always put X's and stuff, so... Yeah, but some people don't. Not giving them back. Read, I wouldn't yeah. say read too much. It's a, I think that's key. Just maintaining a conversation, when, not giving yeah. back when maintaining a conversation. Yeah, like when you say what you're up to. Yeah, what you up to, I'm okay. I think also oh, making yeah. excuses, like when you don't want to Yeah, that, excuses. I think thing. it's the same thing that you guys do that we do. It's like when someone's not interested, mm. they're just not giving you that same energy back. Exactly. Like yeah, you're, and it feels like you're forcing You can it. tell you're forcing conversation. Yeah. yeah I think also, another yeah. one, if they aren't asking you questions, they don't care. Literally. <laughs> and if you're asking all the questions, and if Daniel you're the one saying, guys. yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> but if like if they're not asking, creating convo, they're just answering to your questions. They're just being polite. Doesn't mean they're interested. Key word is energy. Literally, that yeah, said it. Energy. Yeah. If the energy's not there, I think you can pick it up as well. Yeah. Hundred. Careful, you might squeeze first. Another question. You might squeeze me. Do you guys prefer makeup or no makeup? No, no makeup. What's your opinions on makeup? Well, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. No makeup. You always change your answer. No, no makeup. <laughs> yeah, However, <laughs> when you go out, you gotta have some makeup. But I can't. I don't like when women have like all this contouring thing and then they wipe Oh, you know the word. And then they wipe it off. <laughs> they wipe it off and they're completely different. Like a clown, right? Hey? No, there's different. Have you seen that meme where like this part, this girl yeah. has like an accident and, and all the makeup yeah, and, and all they the leave makeup. like yeah. all the stains It's like, there. mate, when you go hug a girl and you got a white shirt on and she leaves a, a stain on makeup. Yeah, I'm, that shirt. Well, I'm, <laughs> what I'm going to say is makeup for some girls is not because they're insecure. It's just a form of art. It's the way they express themselves. Mm. Yeah, I, I got no, I got no, nothing against it. I prefer natural beauty, but uh, some people look stunning with makeup. Though. Yeah, I, I, yeah, but then they change it back. They they look stunning with makeup, but then you've got to look at. I'm waking up to this to this girl next day, <laughs> and it's a completely different girl because she doesn't look the same with, okay, with exactly. makeup. Every, no, there's some every, women that do yeah. that. I mean, it's sort of a I think I think I'm, I'm with you. I like natural girls, but obviously, like a girl, a girl wants to wear makeup. I think like, a girl can do. A girl can do what a girl wants to exactly. do. Exactly. I'm not you know against it. I'm never. I like hat natural wearing makeup, well, but makeup also looks good on natural beauty or not. I'm like, whatever. Don't get me wrong. I don't mind women wearing makeup. That's their makeup. Like Pat, I don't mind Pat wearing makeup if she wants to like one day dress up and whatnot. But what do you use? Just mascara and eyeliner. There you go. Mm. Like, but then there's this, these women but I'm not that into use, makeup like, so like that. much. I know what you mean. They use well, there's like padding. Color. Yeah, there's like padding on their face. Padding, and then they yeah. start doing like. And you notice the bit. It's like there's a layer, you like can, you, can, you can put your finger through it. <laughs> well, I've seen on, in like some girls wearing this. Maybe, thick my opinion is, yeah, yeah, like if you're that close to that girl, maybe ask why she wears that makeup. Yeah, true. I mean, it, maybe understand mm. why the girl wears it. Because some girls don't wear it because they want to be someone else. They wear it honestly because it's just like a form of art, it's the way they express yeah. themselves. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. By the way, I'm not against women make wearing makeup. That's just. And you know what they say: the male equivalent of makeup is a haircut. No, it's and good. It's different. During COVID, we're all feeling that. Well, not really. I'm not. I'm not bad. Well, you're getting yeah, trimmed from the missus. Listen, <laughs> listen, you could get. I'm trimmed feeling, by your but mom. I'm enjoying the growth. You could get trimmed by your mum and your and your sister or your dad. No, I'm not. Like, Shout out to the Masida family. But I don't trust them. <laughs> <laughs> Next no question. question: What makes a girl sexually attractive? Mm. Ooh, <laughs> this comes down to personal preference in terms of um, like body shapes and all that sort of stuff. I think it does come down to personal I think, preference. I think it's weird, but I think also vibe and energy is big. Like they don't even have to be. Not everyone has to think they're good looking, but as long as you're sexually attracted to them, yeah. then it's just there. It's just a vibe and but energy. This is not like I'm not saying in the sense of like going into a relationship with yeah. them. But imagine like you're just with a group of friends and you're like, oh, she's like fit. Yeah. You know what I mean? You're but sexually attracted to her, but you don't even know her personality. It completely yet. depends, like, f from person to person. Like, I would like something different to me, to Ivan, completely, and to David, just in the persona. Like, maybe if there's a really loud, big energy, I might be a bit more attracted to that than maybe, and I'm not saying this is the case, but maybe David likes a girl who's a bit more shy and reserved. Not that it's the case, it could be anyone else, do you know what I mean? But everyone <laughs> yes, not. But everyone has their own preferences. But um I think it's just Okay, that so what energy. do you go for when you see a girl? Well <laughs> like at the end of the day, physical attraction. You yeah, have to have physical, physical attraction. attraction. There's physical attraction. It could be hair, it can be whatever. There's physical attraction and then there's like there's there's what you like. You your know. prototype. Yeah, your like type, I suppose. Yeah, but, but what's your type? 
Yeah, but it doesn't mean you don't. I, I've got like I could tell no, you got type, but I've yeah, gone you away can from have my a type. type. But then you know, usually, then usually I like petite tan brunette. But then I've had I, I've been with like blonde tall and not too tan. Do you know what I mean? So I've yeah, not going for the, for the person like like it varies. Yeah, you always not I think, the I, think, I, think I, I don't really think it's even physical. I think it, it's more. I think the physical's like just a tick box, but it's there. But I think the big thing is when you vibe with that person, you have that energy when you're both sexually attracted. You can feel sexual attraction. Yeah, I feel like you can feel sexual attraction. But you can tell when you when you're getting it, okay, when you're so receiving it, and when you're giving another it. Another question: When you see a girl, what's the first thing you look at? Hmm. Easy. Damn it! Hair. The hair. Yep. Okay, that's face, smile, and like teeth and eyes. Smile and teeth. Hundred. But imagine, okay, so let's say she's from behind. You know, we'll look at her teeth straight away. Well, I don't like because I've been with you, you guys. Look at from behind? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I've been with you guys, and teeth is definitely not the first thing you guys look at. So you guys are here all lying. No, 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 one hundred percent. No, 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 no,
Oh, Amy, anyway, she's found a it's juicy one. one. It's one, one with juicy Have one. you ever watched porn before being sexually active with someone? <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. Have you ever watched porn before you've been sexually active with someone? Have watch- you ever needed to watch porn before being with someone? No, I was watching porn while I was. I'm with not someone. talking before about having sex with someone. I'm <laughs> not saying like no. two hours before, but like five minutes before. Just no. to get yourself going. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just get a little head start. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. Never. Oh, you guys just lying. No. no. <laughs> oh, have you? What? I thought that's why you're laughing. No, I'm laughing at you <laughs> and your comment. That's fair. Oh, oh, no. Yeah. How much porn is too much porn? There is never too much porn. <laughs> no, there is too much porn. I mean, there is too much porn. <laughs> oh, there is. There is, but... So where's your stop, like? If you beat your meat that. more than five times a day, you've got an issue, mate. Well, yeah. yeah oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but... No. But that's not just... But you don't have to watch porn to beat your meat. Beat your meat. <laughs> yeah. You can just watch porn. Yeah, but that's not. Nah. Like, if you watch porn for the purpose, you don't watch porn just to watch porn. No, like, it's, not, it's not freaking. Some people do. Yeah. You'd not some people do. You'd be surprised. Well, some people do. Yeah, you'd be surprised. I mean, they are actors. I don't know. Yeah, like, like I don't think there's too I mean, maybe there's like. definitely a point where it's like an obsession. Yeah. But, like, if you're just. If you're you paying porn, to watch it. Okay, yeah. Like, if you're paying to watch yeah, it. Why would then you pay? I never understood. When that. there's free sites. You if you made back in the day, you buy yourself a VHS tape, <laughs> set yourself yeah, up. Like, like if you're <laughs> paying. Pre hard times. Those are my friends. Like, if you're paying. You remember that, ep- that episode where um, Joey and Chandler have porn at home? Like, oh, that is funny. Free, yeah, free so porn. <laughs> and they're just at the sofa. Yeah, if you're, if you're, if you're, that, that is too much porn. <laughs> I think if you're, if you're paying for it, that, that's got to the point where you need some help. Right. Right, next question. Mm, that's a bit weird. Do you guys really feel no attachment after sex? Depends on what girl they I think it's possible. Girl. It is possible to have no Depends what girl. There is one night stands where you just be like, you know, it can be very yeah. transactional. But no attachment whatsoever. No attachment whatsoever. It can be the case. But it depends on the girl. But if you're seeing a girl and then you have sex, obviously it does mean something. Yeah. But if you meet someone in a, in a club and you just go, Back to her place or back to your place. But if you're seeing someone and you have sex, it's not like you're not gonna have attachment. If you are seeing someone and you have sex with them, you are gonna have attachment. Yeah. Okay. But if it's, it depends how you meet what you know them from. Next question is, can you make love to someone that you're actually not in love with? Right. Oh, Flash wants to weigh in here. <laughs> Flash, what do you think? <laughs> I shag everyone. Um, I'd say yes, you can. Yeah. Yeah, well, 100%. depends. Depend, but like, there's a lot of people that are like making love is making love, and there's just sex. Like, if if you're viewing it all as it's, it's sex, you're having sex with someone that's making love, then you can have sex with anyone. Because I, I can vouch. Is there a difference from sex and love? Massively. Making love and making sex and having Massively. sex. Massively. And you could do that without. <laughs> just like, wow. And you could do that without. Little, I don't know. I suppose a little bit. And yeah. you could make love without. You can make love because like. I don't mind if this is a record to be fair, but um, Paul, <laughs> <laughs> big no. stuff here, boys. <laughs> no, 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 no. What, what I'm trying to say is, is, I've never, I like. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Submit it out, mate. Let me let's, 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 let's try let me this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you can, um, you cannot be in love with someone, but at the end of the day, when you're having a sexual interaction with the other person. At the end of the day, the only one you, the only person you want to have a sexual interaction with is that person. Because at the end of the day, you want to know where it leads to, where it gets pursued. You know what I mean? Not, not really, because you, you can be in sexual interaction. interactions with loads of women at the same time. How many guys is there that just go to a club and like... I'm a one-girl girl person, do you know what I mean? Yeah. That's just me. So, when I'm, when I'm devouring all my time and attention to pursue something with one girl, that I know it could potentially head in the correct direction. But then you're looking at it with a perspective of possibly falling in love with that person. Exactly, but... So that's what I'm saying. But then you're still looking with the perspective of falling in love with that person yeah, but to every make single love time, with that person. But every single time I have an sexual interaction, for me, that's already making love because I'm invested in that girl. I'm interested in that girl. I'm not interested in no one else. So have you never had sex just to have sex? Yeah. Well, then that's that's what we're talking about. But I'm at the same time I'm saying you can make love but wait, when without being in love. love. Yeah. Because... At that stage when I'm making love with this person, this I'm not in love with. But, that, but you're that still thinking in a perspective of in the future. <laughs> so you just though. say yes or no? What do you think? Can no. What? Can you make love to someone without being in love? 
You can't make if you're saying making love is just having sex. Yeah, you can. It's not just having sex. No. Okay. Well, that's not the work. question. No, no you that's wouldn't be making question. love. The question is: be... Can you make love to someone you have no that you do not love? I think tell me what making love is specifically. It's different for everyone. Have you guys ever felt attractive, attracted to your girlfriend's friends? To your girlfriend's friends? Ooh. Oh, to your <laughs> girlfriend's friends. <laughs> Okay, I'll ask Not another one. Yeah, 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 that's yeah, what I'm gonna yeah. ask after. So first answer that one. To your girlfriend's friends. So like even my friends. So has, I mean I've never so had a serious serious serious. So has Danny felt attracted to So imagine you had a friend, you've been attracted yeah, to Yeah, has friend. he ever been attracted to my friend? I can't really answer this question honestly because I've never really had a serious Okay, okay, okay not even girlfriend then, just a, like a thing you've had. The fine attractive. Or someone you've been seeing and then. Oh is it attracted. are you attracted? Yeah. yeah. You You can be attracted yeah, but when I've you never assume anything. Yeah, but I've never been in that situation because I think if you're fully like in it with that person you're going out with, you wouldn't view it. But you can you can be like she's good looking or or yeah, like, I can see why people find her attractive. So for example, with flings that I used to have, I was oh, yeah, you could say that you look at another at one of her friends and be like, do you know what? She's actually more good looking than the one I'm having a fling with. I'm lucky, mate. <laughs> the wrong one. Exactly. I chose the wrong one. <laughs> That's it. In my instance, no, because I I've only been in one relationship and I haven't met a lot of uh, female friends, so um, no. I was only interested. All right. I was only interested. Last question. <laughs> Last question. Have you guys ever been attracted to your friend's girlfriend? No. To your friend's girlfriend. Bro, cold. You do not step on that. You do not step that line, and if yeah, you yeah, but do, we're saying <laughs> no. Wait, wait, wait. Let's be honest. 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 let us I, you think they're good looking and you think, you know, like, you can see that you might have a Bible that, that there's something going on. But do you then actually do something about it? No. Yeah, you don't have to. But attraction. Like... No. And, I mean, you guys have been with each other's own girlfriends, so I think you're lying. <laughs> so, <laughs> hey. I know you were 16 or whatever you were. Oh, you were 12. You can't even say that. Wait, you've done that. No, I'm for a week. Say, like, <laughs> I'm not saying, like, I'm not saying someone you've different. been with for like 7, no, 8, 10 not. years. I'm talking about, like, for example, David comes up to you and goes, Eva, look, I met this, like, this girl. You will never look at that girl and be like, oh, she's quite attractive. You've never done that. I think that's Okay, the fine attraction. But this is a thing. She looks pretty, she's pretty, she's beautiful. But that's not yet. Yeah, 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 that's not yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, it is, yeah, yeah. though. Yes, it is. Why is it not? Why is it not you being attracted to that person? Doesn't so mean she's beautiful. Acting on it. Oh, thanks. As opposed to. Anna, you're beautiful as well. Do you know what I mean? It's completely different. Yeah, I think. I think. Why not? I think you guys just think differently, like, you think yeah. You can be attractive, like, doesn't mean you can about, do it. Like you said, yeah. broken, like, I've never, ever, ever, like, I could be, like, oh my god, like, Pat, we have such a vibe, I'm so attracted, like, I, mean, I feel like maybe this time, I would never do anything <laughs> in my face, like, like, bro, <laughs> I'm like, I have to do <laughs> what were you saying? <laughs> no, I don't, no, never in a million yeah, years would I do something. Um, I know that if they want to go out, then I can just shoot both. If it's just maybe attractions, like, do, do you find Patricia attractive? Do you think she's beautiful? Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. But then when it comes to actually having a connection of feeling or yeah. actually going behind you guys back and text messaging and stuff like that. That's different. That's yeah. different. That, that you but you're saying, oh, do you find Patricia pretty or attractive? Like, yeah, she's pretty good. Sort of. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. That's what I meant. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Then, yeah. All right, I'm going to do a, a, a bonus question. Would you ever take a girl back if she's cheated on you? No. Hell no! No. She was like answering, but uh, it's horrible. She never cheated on anyone. No, 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 just oh. never Like Danny said, I'd rather get a text message just saying, like, babe, like, yeah, if someone, if someone's gonna cheat on me, we spoke about this the other day, literally, literally, send me a text, say, I'm breaking up with you, and then do whatever you want. I'd rather that than you cheat on me, because at least Danny, I know that's oh, it. Oh, so you guys are giving me another question. Because then Danny oh, can have the green light to go gang by the Would you tell your friend's girlfriend that he's cheated on her? Ooh. I put a load of pressure on my friend. <laughs> David, put that pillow down right now! <laughs> I would tell my friend 
to yeah. do it to I tell her. I put a load of pressure on her. to tell her. I'd actually bully my friend to yeah, tell him his girlfriend that he's cheated on her. But you would never physically go to her no. and say? No. 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 Well, it depends I, on, depends on, on their level. I think it yeah. like, depends, depends on the friendship no, I have with the girl. It depends on the friendship you have with the girl, exactly. But I'd do that. I'd, I'd, I'd be putting so much pressure on my mate to tell, him, to tell her. And my relationship with my mate would be sort of not dying right. Down. Because Until it would be dying down. It would be dying yeah. off. It would be dying off. And and if it gets to a point where I think personally, you know what? She de- she deserves to know the truth. I'll I don't feel like... But wait, are you guys talking about a friend that's been with this person for years or been with them just for a few months? No, for years. You, I mean, I've done know the girl for a few months. So yeah. like, a few months, a year, whatever. So what do you, where, where do you guys think is like, okay, that's it. You can't cheat from then. Like, I will tell you. You, you can't cheat. I know, I know. But well, like... Just a few months. I will say it's like, mate, like... You got to be honest. You have to be honest. Be it three months. As soon as they started going out, there's no because they're official. If, if that's your yeah. girlfriend, you're saying she's your girlfriend. Even if it's one day in, I don't think yeah. there's a time limitation to to when you can cheat or when. You... All right then, that's it then. Like I've never cheated and I've never planned on cheating. Yeah, I've never. I just can't cheat. Agreed. When I'm with one person, I just I just laugh into this. I just. That's Aww. Anyway. Ain't right, that guys. Cute. Ain't that fuck you? <laughs> <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If what what should they comment if they enjoyed this video, guys? Comment down below if... What questions and what answers yeah, do you agree do a, with the most? Or we could do a part two and then... Yeah, you want a part two. Yeah, we could, yeah, maybe do... What questions and answers do you guys agree with the most? Any new questions and we could do a part two? Yeah, that'd be good. That'd be a good idea. Or next time we could do it the other way. You guys ask us questions. Yeah. Yeah, next time you bring some of your girlfriends and we'll just grill them. Yeah, we'll grill them, of course. <laughs> be ready. <laughs> Alright guys, if you like this video, don't forget to... Like, comment, share, subscribe. Yay! Boom! Well done, mate. Got it right. (laughs) It only took Um, 10 videos, but you know. (laughs) And yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. See you later.